What to do when the Tesla app won't connect to your car? Make sure your device is connected to data or Wi-Fi. Go to Add Remove Products, Add, Vehicle, then follow the on-screen prompts to add your car. It takes 3 to 5 days for your car to be added. On your car's touchscreen, go to Controls, Safety, Allow Mobile Access. Turn on your phone's Bluetooth and pair the phone with your Tesla. Your app will connect to your car automatically from now on. Your device may prevent the Tesla app from using mobile data until you give it permission. Enable mobile data for the Tesla app under your device's settings, then try connecting the app to your car. Your app might be glitching. Reset the app by closing and reopening it, then try connecting it to your car. Make sure the app is fully closed before opening it again. Glitchy apps can sometimes be fixed by restarting your phone. Power your device down completely, then restart it and open the Tesla app. If your phone was the problem, you should now be able to connect to the car. Allow the Tesla app to always access your location. To fix this issue, go to your device's location settings and allow the Tesla app to access your location at all times. Your app may not function correctly if it's out of date. Go to your device's settings to update the Tesla app to the latest version. Make sure the update finishes before you reopen the app. Apps sometimes break or stop working. To fix this, delete the Tesla app from your device. Then download it again from your device's app store. Log into the app and connect to your car. The cache contains data that helps the Tesla app run smoothly, but sometimes this data gets corrupted. Go to your device's settings menu to clear the cache, then log into the app again to connect it to your car. Reboot your car by turning it completely off for 2 minutes. After 2 minutes, press the brake pedal and open the door to wake the vehicle. Then try connecting the app to your car. Your app may not connect if your car's software is out of date. Open the Software tab on your car's touchscreen. If an update is available, you'll see a notification on the display. Select Install Now to download and install the update. Once the update finishes, connect your app to car. Reset the password for your Tesla account. Sometimes, resetting your password can fix issues with the app. Wait two hours if you get a server error message, then try again. A server error message means there is a problem with Tesla's data network, not your app or car. Causes for your app not connecting Your Tesla app is out of date. An outdated app can malfunction unexpectedly. It may fail to connect to Tesla's servers. It may also be unable to recognize your car. Tesla performs routine server maintenance, which can cause their systems to go down unexpectedly. Their servers may also get overloaded by excessive user traffic. This will cause your app to display a server error message. The Tesla app only works when it's connected to the internet. If you're in an area without Wi-Fi or mobile data coverage, the app won't be able to communicate with your car. If you recently purchased your car, you'll need to add it to the mobile app, then pair the app with your car's Bluetooth system. There may be a problem with your Tesla account, or with the car itself. Contact Tesla's customer service team and explain that your app will not connect. They can troubleshoot the problem or fix issues on their end. If your app won't connect and you can't find your key fob, you may not be able to get into your car. Contact Tesla to have them send a roadside assistant to your location. They'll help you manually open your car door. If you're unable to log into your account on the app or website and can't reset your password, contact Tesla support line at 1-888-518-3752 to explain the situation. Your account may be locked down for security purposes, such from typing your password incorrectly too many times. Thank you for watching. Now you are ready to connect the Tesla app to your vehicle with this troubleshooting guide.